Hello guys, how is it going? And today we got another review and it is the Sonic the Hedgehog movie collection figures for the 2.5 inches. Um, we got Buzz Bomber, um, Robotnik or Jim Carrey, Sonic, Knuckles and Tails and as you can see this is the Tails from um, the normal one of course without the gear on or whatever. Also I'm sorry if I'm not prepared to get the other tails out. <clears throat> well, I was gonna be prepared today, but power went out, so. Anyways, that's not important. I got the tails here, and let's take a look at the box first, and then we'll unbox it and review. Here we got the movie logo. Of course, movie figure collection, and then a whole bunch of different languages. Of course, Sonic Tails, Knuckles, Robotnik, and Buzz Bomber, Sonic the Hedgehog 2, movie Sonic logo. Side, we got the same render as the Tornado or biplane. Oh, I'm same on both sides. I don't know why they decided to use that, but okay. Sonic the Hedgehog 2, all the characters on the back. Articulated, of course. And for right now, these are the only way you can get them. But soon, Jack Specific is going to be re releasing Wave 2 of the 4 inches along with single card carded packs for the movie 2.5 inch figures. So if you wanted the movie 2.5 inch figure separately and didn't want to pay 20 or so much on eBay, because 75 is how much I had to pay for mine. Um, then just wait for the single cards carded um, figures to come out and then there you go so now let's unbox this and, uh, you know I'm always never prepared for a freaking video I swear I'm not this happens all the time I just I need to start getting prepared now it's just uh, school and everything just does not make me prepared <laughs> just I got so much school things going on you know and I'm trying to get these videos out to you guys as much as possible um so that way I don't have to upload for a while or at least until like Jack specific news or I don't know, I might be starting my plush videos back up again. Um, let's see. Or until another wave comes up, which wave 9 and um, more 2.5 inch figures are coming soon. Which is nice. But they're not coming until June, which they've been delayed until, so I'm guessing it's for Sonic's 31st anniversary. And they'll be in Sonic 31st Anniversary box art, just like the um, last ones were for the last waves with um, Wave 6 and I think the one with the laughing classic Sonic wave. I kind of forgot. It was stupid. Come on. This tape. Okay. <laughs> Got it. Now I can open it carefully, hopefully, because the tornado biplane thing, I had to, like, literally rip it out, which I was not a fan of doing. Come on. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. It took a bit. Boom. Da -da -da -da. Also, that solar-powered um, classic Sonic that I've seen listed ready for pre-order. Yes, I'm getting him. I don't know when, but GameStop's releasing him too. So, I'm probably going to GameStop to pick him up. So, yeah, there will be a review on him most likely, but there's not going to be much. It depends if there's articulation or whatever on it, and it's just, I mean, it's just a solar-powered classic Sonic tapping his foot. Not really, you know, much. 
All right, I'll be right back. I gotta get the scissors real quick. Well, you know what? Screw the scissors. I do not need them. So let's just take them out then. Shoot. Stop. Stop with my clumsiness. I think. Is he? Oh, okay. Well, I'm done. Could have just done this. No, I'm trying to check if Buzz Bomber um has the ties or whatever they are. And I do not see it. So there we go. Okay, Buzz Bomber's out, and I'll go get the classic version. God damn it! I hate being so unprepared at times. <laughs> And also grab the tornado because we're gonna put Knuckles and Sonic on it. <clears throat> so I'll be right back. Next thing on my checklist, actually be prepared next time for my next video. Which I think I'm doing the Death Egg playset next. So um, I'm not sure if I'll have to get too much stuff ready. But in the, in the meantime, I'll try my best to think about it. Alright, well, Jim Carrey's out. He looks good, but <laughs> save that for the review. So just set. God damn it. Alright, there we go. Yeah, you start hearing me curse again. Back to that old slang. Which I'm trying not to swear much, though, because YouTube in there policies or some stupid crap like that. They hate when channels swear. So I'm really trying to contain myself even though I want to. Maybe more of my plush videos I will, but I got I kinda gotta contain myself. So Oh, I got a frickin' I got Sonic's things stuck, stuck on me. <laughs> oh yeah, this Sonic definitely looks better than the paint airs. There's like, they didn't really paint in this chest, stomach area thing. But. Knuckles is, okay, what? The only ones that were strapped in were Jim Carrey, Sonic, and it looks like Tails. Like, Knuckles and Buzz Bomber, I think the other two were not strapped in. Hang on. Yeah, he was not strapped in. Huh. Alright. Now time to get Tails out. I don't think there's going to be much difference between the Tails and the size of the helmet, so... Yeah. Let's put you right there, and we're going to start with the Buzz Bombers first. Alright, so as you can see... Here are both of the Buzz Bombers, movie and classic, which I kind of hope they'll make a modern one, but I doubt it. Um, as you can see, these are movable for the movie Buzz Bomber, and so are these. Oops, the stand fell off again. Why do I always do this? Okay, anyways, his head is sort of rotatable. Well, just a little bit. His, uh, on the other hand, is not rotatable at all. These are kind of movable, but I wouldn't suggest it. Um, his body is movable, just like this one is. I should say, like, more of his torso, or whatever the hell you call it. <laughs> um, he's got his flame shooting out, and of course no articulation there, where he put his base and his serial number. And he's got this little red eye. It looks really accurate, though, to the movie. Like, I'm I'm really impressed with Jax and what they've been doing lately with classic modern and movie. And now that hearing Ray is going to be in more waves, that's really exciting. Anyways, comparing these two, he is definitely a smaller Buzz Bomber to this one. So, yeah, there's movie Buzz Bomber and... Or as in comparison to classic <laughs> classic Buzz Bomber. Oops. Next is our boy. 
Robotnik slash Jim Carrey. And I have to say, this is the most accurate, accurate figure of the entire world. Like, the... That's this is just so spot on to like actual Jim Carrey. Um, the only issues that I seem to have with mine only is, as you can see, this is on the act or this is accurate, like you know, whereas Jackie goes, but on my as you can see on mine, this these were placed wrong, but that is just a minor detail that I really don't care about. Other than that, it's like really good. Oh, look, you know, smooth is bottom cape right here or bottom thing right here his head is movable his arm is also movable as you can see you can also do that and apparently with the four inch which i also have i haven't unboxed it yet um but as i'm speaking right now i will have the four inches unboxed some other time anyways his little head is movable arms Legs, torso, not really, per se. See, it's not, yeah, it's not really. Uh-oh. Okay, I wouldn't try that, actually, because you can end up plopping out their legs like I just did. <laughs> Oopsies. <laughs> it's okay. If he doesn't, yeah, I'll fix him after this video. Don't worry, I'll fix him. So, yeah. There's a really accurate Jim Carrey, and I freaking love it. Amazing job, Jax. Oh, okay. Now let's just move Broken Eggman to the side. Next, we got our new Sonic that I'm going to be or take as my replacement. He's got the same holes. Legs are movable. Arms are movable. Just a little bit, but no, wait, no, I'm just doing it wrong. <laughs> Head is movable. No, I'm great. Or all in. Um, in all, he's a great figure, except this part. I don't know what Jax was trying to do with this mo the movie Sonic stuff. Because they're like, you're like, oh, okay, stop here. And then just like the rest of his body circle is not there. It, it It's weird. But I mean, okay, I guess. I, I don't know. Um, shoes are really accurate, everything is really, really accurate, and I like this movie Sonic. Great figure. And here we got movie knuckles, as you can see, head's not movable due to the, yeah, that. Um, movable arms, movable legs. All around is actually a really good figure. For especially a small one like Jax really knows how how to do their scales of figures too. He looks a little angry, which I don't know how I feel about that, but I mean, whatever. And here's tails, normal tails, of course, normal movie tails and movie tails with his glasses or whatever. So as you can see, really not much of a difference, just. That's on top of him now. And again, his tails are rotatable, movable arms, t articulation basically everywhere for him. Um, I really like him as well. He's a good figure as well. It's amazing and spot on. Now, the last thing I wanted to do before ending off this video was, like I said, show you guys knuckles sonic and tails on the tornado so i'm going to do that real quickly i'm gonna put knuckles on the side of the tornado come on come on he's not fitting i might have to do something about that oh hold on and here are they all in the tornado kind of oops kind of hard to get knuckles on because you want to know why yeah he's a pretty heavy figure but there you go all right guys well i hope you enjoyed today's video and i'll see you the next time for the death like playset well playset review see ya